Hey guys, I thought I'd do a nice easy one today. After last week's Tolkien ring, a lot of you said sculpting something complex in Blender was a bit demanding. So I thought I'd demonstrate a simpler use of Blender. My son recently suggested making a Mandalorian ring. But rather than sculpt one from scratch, let's make use of the kind maker donations on Thingiverse. I just want the Mandalorian's helmet and there's far more suitable files here. But this one better demonstrates what's possible. Using the boolean tools and just simple shapes, it's easy to cut away unwanted sections of the 3D model. Well, I wasn't expecting that. Now I know there's probably better ways of doing what I'm doing here, but I'm still new to Blender and I'm still learning. I've got a long way to go. Again, the boolean tools and simple shapes can be used to repair any unwanted recesses. It prints up nicely.
It might be Elvis brewed, but I guess we'll just have to see. Silver would have been a better colour choice, but a lot of my silver is on holiday in Denmark at the moment, visiting Oliver of Shaping Silver. You'll find out why in a few weeks. Hmm, maybe it's time to get a new crucible. Well, these don't look too bad. The castings are quite clean, so clean up is minimal. And there you go, not too shabby. The castings have a few imperfections, but by and large, I'm quite pleased with them. But importantly, it's a nice demonstration of how we can use the generously donated files of Thingiverse and convert them to a whole different purpose using Blender. I hope you enjoyed this one, guys. Take care and thanks for watching.